part by Inked Playmats at inkplaymats.com. Your place for custom-made playmats. Design your own or shop from other featured designers. Use promo code CLOTS to save 10% on your order. Inked Playmats. Your game, your style. Hello everybody, this is Kevin from Clots Productions, back with another Magic the Gathering match. For this match, we have Will playing his own build of green-white humans, and he's going up against Tyler Wynn playing blue-red Delver. Will ended up taking a mulligan down to six cards and then led on the play with a Razor Verge Thicket. Tyler then laid down an island and used the cast to ponder. He chose to rearrange the cards and leave them on the top. Will then laid down a plains and resolved a skin shifter. Then Tyler put a mountain into play and used it to resolve a grim lava mancer. Will's third land was a Sun Petal Grove. He then resolved a Hamlet Captain and attacked with his Skin Shifter. He decided to pump the Skin Shifter to a 4-4, which Tyler took, going down to 16. For Tyler's next turn, he thought for a minute and then decided to cast Chandra's Phoenix. However, Will then used a Fiend Hunter to exile the Phoenix and then attacked with his other two creatures for another 4 damage, dropping Tyler to 12. Tyler simply played Land Go for his next turn, and the Will resolved a Champion of the Parish. When the Champion came into play, Tyler used an Incinerate to kill the Fiend Hunter and get his Phoenix back. Will then chose to attack with just his Skin Shifter. Tyler blocked it with his Phoenix, so Will pumped the Skin Shifter. However, in response, Tyler uses Grim Lava Mancer to exile two cards and kill the Skin Shifter. For Tyler's next turn, he started off by putting a Shrine of Burning Rage into play. He followed it up with a second Phoenix, adding a counter to the Shrine. Then for combat, he decided to attack with just one Phoenix, dropping Will to 18. For Will's next turn, he started off by resolving a Mentor of the Meek. Then for combat, he attacked with his champion along with his captain. Tower decided to trade one of his Phoenixes with the captain and then take the other 3 damage from the champion, going down to 9 life. Tyler's Shrine got another counter on it and then he used it to kill Will's Mentor. He then followed it up by using his Lava Mancer to exile the two cards in his graveyard and kill the champion. Then for combat, he attacked with his Phoenix again, dropping Will to 16. Will then attempted to resolve the Gat Staff Shepherd, however Tower countered it with a Mana Leak, so Will followed it up with a Mayor of Averbrook. Tower didn't do anything on his next turn, and then during Will's upkeep, for whatever reason, he didn't transform his Mayor. He then attempted to resolve a Fiend Hunter, however Tower flashed in a Snapcaster Mage and gave his Mana Leak flashback. He then used the Mana Leak to counter the Fiend Hunter. Then on his turn, he attacked with a Snapcaster, which Will didn't block, going down to 14. Will remembered to transform his Mayor this time. He then cast a Daybreak Ranger, however Tower countered it with another Mana Leak. Will then attacked with his Mayor, so Tyra blocked it with his Phoenix and then finished it off with his Grim Lava Mancer. Tyler then played a Delver of Secrets and then attacked, dropping Will to 11. Will passed his next turn after drawing his card and then Tyler revealed an Incinerate on the top of his library, transforming his Delver into an Insectable Aberration. He then attacked for another 6 damage, dropping Will to 5. Will then drew another land and decided to go ahead and scoop it up, giving Tower the win and taking them to game 2. So that's it for this game. I hope you all enjoyed it. You can find the full version in the annotations at the end of the video, along with previous highlights gameplays. And as always, if you like this or any other video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and add it to your favorites, and then you can subscribe to be notified when more gameplays are online.